guys welcome back to my channel my name is Raina and I'm so glad you're here in today's video I'm bringing you another stitch fix unboxing this is my unboxing and try on for the month of May 2019 and this box just screams spring and summer and I'm really excited about it because it was a five out of five not 100% 5 out of 5, but we'll get into that. I'm going to explain some of the items. Um, there is a dress in here, and on like my styling card thing, the dress doesn't really look like what it does like in person. I think maybe the print might vary, but it doesn't look the same like at all. So I'm not sure what happened there. May ask about that. Regardless, I mean, I do like the dress, but. There are some issues with sizing and things in this box, so I may have to do some exchanges. Really excited to show you what I got. While you're here, uh, go ahead and hit the subscribe button and hit the thumbs up. I would really appreciate it. My Stitch Fix videos seem to be doing really well, so thank you guys so much for tuning into those. And without further ado, let's go ahead and get to the box. Okay, so my stylist for most of the winter um, was Crystal. And then my last box, Crystal is not my stylist. They said that she doesn't work there anymore, so I was really sad about that. Um, but I did have another stylist, Caitlin, and Caitlin, she just missed the mark a little bit, and unfortunately, I sent everything back. So, um, this box, I have a new stylist, her name is Natalie, and quit, babe. I'm not going to read the styling note because it's pretty generic, so we're just going to go ahead and get into the items. So, the first item is a shirt, and it is a tank top that has, like, this crochet detail on the shoulders which is absolutely gorgeous i really really like this um i have been wanting to try out some bralettes and this would give me an excuse to wear a bralette because it wouldn't look quite right with a bra sticking out um so this is a beautiful print it is navy with like a coral um paisley with um lime green and honestly the camera or the ring lights kind of blinding me today so it's hard for me to see um this shirt is 96 percent percent rayon and four percent spandex and it is a really super cute like i thought this was adorable on it was a little bit big but i do like it all the way around aside from that and i think this is going to be really good for the summertime especially for when my sister and i are singing we do a lot of like outdoor picnics and things like that. So I'm really excited about this. It is called the Paper Moon Sobby Crochet Detail Knit Tank. It's in the color navy size 2X. So I'm thinking I'm going to size down to a 1X and it's $44. The next item is a top as well and it's from the brand Paper Moon. It is called the Fayette Mixed Material Blouse in the color coral. It's a size 2X. Also, I think I'm going to size down in this one to a 1X, and it's $38. So, this, it's called mixed material because the front is like a non-stretchy, um, I don't know, we'll look at it. And then the back is very, like, relaxed and stretchy. Um, it's just kind of a simple, it's got like a little split neck on it. Um, it fits pretty well. I, I love the color. Uh, actually, Taryn has the same shirt in her box in white, so... Good to know that it comes in other colors if I really like it. But I do think I'm going to size down in this. Um, let's see what kind of fabric we got here. Mm, 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 mm. Okay, so I'm not sure exactly. It's a self 100% polyester and then contrast 95% rayon, 5% spandex. So I'm thinking that the front part of it is 100% polyester because it doesn't have any stretch to it. And then the back part is... The rayon and spandex blend because it's stretchy um i think this is beautiful it actually goes really well with the next item let's go ahead and get into that okay so the next item is the thing that i was probably most excited about when i looked on my phone on the app i have to cheat pretty much every month i'm just so excited to find out what i'm gonna get unfortunately this item is also a little bit big let me just say this um i have been losing weight for a while now and so I am aware of this and some of my sizes have gone down like in some things I'm a 1x but in some things I'm still a 2x I'm a pretty much a solid 20 still on the bottom I can do an 18 in some dress pants but it just completely depends so on the stitch fix apps a 2x is 20 to 22 and a 1x is 16 to 18 well 
I feel kind of afraid to do a 1X on my style profile because I'm actually more of an 1820, which to me is a 2X. So I don't know, I'm kind of in between on the sizes. That's why I've been kind of sizing up. I think I would rather size up than size down. I don't know. I've been in between on that. Especially since I am losing weight, it's hard to be like, well, I'll just go ahead and size down. You know, we'll grow into it, hopefully. But I've been losing, I lost weight really quickly in the beginning and then I've lost weight a lot slower. You know, talking like point something pounds a week for like the last three months or something like that. I had a two pound loss a couple of weeks ago and I was just like, I don't even know how to act right now. Anyway, let's get into the next item. It is a kimono and it is freaking gorgeous. Like I am so excited about this. Um, it's from the brand Ava James. It's called the Simonette Open Kimono. Simonette, we're gonna go with that. <laughs> the open Kimono, the color Off-White. Actually, they should have just said multi because it's got all kinds of crazy colors. Size so 2X, $38. That is a really good price for this. You'll see like how generous it is as far as the length and just this print is absolutely beautiful. Like gorgeous. Like I just don't know. Now, some people don't like prints. They like plain clothes. But for me personally, I love prints. And this was the thing that I was just like, dead excited for. It is 100% polyester. On the um, app, I thought it looked kind of silky. It's not. It's just like that non-stretchy, but I don't care. I don't know what else I can say about this, except that I absolutely love it. Um, I am going to have to size down to a 1X. So that is very frustrating because I think I'm going to have to do an exchange for on quite a few of these items. <sighs> I'm actually kind of nervous because I really like almost everything in this box and I don't know what I'm going to keep. So, anyway, I do think I know what I'm keeping and what I'm not keeping. We'll talk about that at the end. I love this kimono. The next item I want to talk about is the jeans in the box. Um, they're from the brand Democracy, and they're in a size 20W, and they're called the Absolution Jeans. Um, Stitch Fix calls them the Democracy Catherine Bootgut Jean in the color Indigo, size 20W. Um, and they are, while we're talking about it, they're $68. So a lot of the jeans that I've received from Stitch Fix in the past are usually more than that. So I feel like that's a pretty good price. And I was talking to a friend of mine and she was like, Gap jeans are usually like 70 bucks and they last. So eh, I'm totally willing to invest in something as long as it lasts. But I did look these up on Amazon and a couple of other places. Um, I think something that they sort of specialize in is this um, stretchy waistband. It's designed to not gap in the back and that was like a huge plus for me. I always struggle with that, um, especially since I've been losing weight. That's just really been an issue. So I'm really excited with the way these fit in the waist. Um, they were maybe a little bit tight in the legs, but I mean, I think that's kind of how they're supposed to be. They're just supposed to fit kind of tight. They're supposed to just fit really good. And I think they did. They're a boot cut style, which is typically what I prefer. Um, they're really, really dark uh, wash. I don't really know about that kind of going into summer, um, but I'm a pretty solid 20 on the bottom, at least in these jeans. Let's look at the fabric on these. Um, Wow, this has all kinds of stuff in it. Um, it's 54% cotton, 27% rayon, 17% polyester, and 2% spandex. So, all kinds of materials in these jeans. They're the perfect size. They're honestly the perfect fit. It's going to be hard to say no to these because they're kind of perfect. So, yeah. But I really like them. Okay, so we're down to the last item in the box. And once again, my stylist sent a maxi dress. Um, I wanted one for Easter, uh, for April. And then this box came a little bit after Easter. I'm going to call it the May box because it's really late April. So, um, but this dress is really beautiful. Um, I wasn't like totally excited about it when I saw on the app. Now, let me show you the styling card. I don't know if you can see that. Okay, so if you can tell, the dress looks very pink. It has like a stripe at the bottom and then like a piece in the middle that like cinches you in. It's kind of empire wasted, but it doesn't look purple at all. And there's no stripes except for like the bottom in the middle. 
Okay, so there's that. This dress doesn't look anything like that. Um, it's actually purple. Um, but it does kind of have like a little keyhole cut out in the neck. And then in the back, I'm not sure you can see this, but it does like have a couple of buttons. They've got like the stretchy uh, piece that you can button them closed. Um, and it does have the little section in the middle, but I'm guessing again that the print just varies because it has all kinds of stripes, like all the way down the dress. And on the feature card, it doesn't look like that at all. So it's really confusing. I love this dress. I'm not like, I'm not totally against the dress on the card. I just don't know if this is right. I don't know if it's just that the print varies or what's going on with it. It's really cute, but it was way too big. Like, way too big. I might even have to size down, like, two sizes <laughs> in order to make it work because it was just really, really big. So, this is the Pamela Knit Maxi Dress um, from the brand Wisp. It's in the color purple, size 20W, and it's $88. So, it is a little bit pricey, um, but if it were in a size that fit, I would really like it, I think. And also, did I even get the right dress? I'm just really confused on what happened with this dress, but it's pretty. I do like it overall. Let's talk about what we're keeping. Okay, so if you've never signed up for Stitch Fix, I do have a link down in the description box below so you can sign up and get your first box for free. Um, if you've never done it before, you actually normally pay a $20 styling fee and then whatever you buy in the box, your $20 will go towards. Um, basically, a stylist will just pick out five items for you. They pick out those items based on how you fill out your style profile and your Pinterest boards and things like that. I absolutely love Stitch Fix. This is fix number 19 for me, and I did DN Co. for about a year before I did Stitch Fix, and Stitch Fix just seems to be a much better fit. I am actually a Style Pass member. That was something that I opted into after being enrolled for a couple of months, and I'm, I'm super glad that I did because the last couple of boxes haven't been 100% my favorite. Okay, if I were to keep everything in this box, um, before the discounts, I would pay $276. Um, since I don't have a styling fee, my only discount is the 25% on the whole box if I buy everything. That is $69. Um, so the total I would pay for this box is $207. Um, the discount is actually pretty much the price of the jeans because the jeans were $68. So let's say if I bought everything, I would get the jeans for free. So I've already tried everything on and I'm really in a debate. I'm not sure what I'm keeping. Um, because honestly, I really like everything. I think it's a five out of five in that sense. Um, but obviously, lots of sizing issues. The two tops were too big. The jeans were perfect. I think the kimono was a little bit big. The dress was way too big. <sighs> so I don't really know what to do. I feel like it is so hard to pass up a good pair of jeans. So I really wanna keep them, but I have another pair of jeans that's like almost exactly like them. And the problem that I have with those jeans is that they just kind of ride down a little bit. And I think that the waistband in these jeans is really going to make a difference there. <sighs> I'm just kind of talking this out because <laughs> I'm just like, I don't know what to do. Okay. So the Paper Moon tank, I really like that a lot. I think that I'm going to just exchange that because I think it's going to be perfect for the summer. Um, the... Paper Moon Coral Blouse. Um, I really like that a lot too. It went really well with the kimono. So I think if I just size down in both of those, it will fit me a lot better. And I think I'll just like it much better overall. But I love both of them already. So I think if I size down, they'll be perfect. Um, again, it's hard to pass with the jeans. And then the dress, honestly, it's $88. Daddy. And as I said, the jeans were $68. So those are the two most expensive items in the box. I think that I could keep um, the tank, or both tanks, I guess, both tanks, both tops, and then the kimono for around $100, and then that would be much better. I normally budget around $50 a box. That's usually, I like usually maybe one or two items, and that's about it, but in this box, I've got a lot of winners, so I think I'm going to exchange some of these items and get a smaller size, and then we'll just go from there. Thank you guys so much for tuning in to this unboxing and try-on 
for May 2019. I am really, really happy with this box and this stylist. So, Natalie, I will be sure and request you again. <laughs> so, we've had a visitor in and out of this video. Say hi. Hi. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. You want to give it a thumbs up? Thumbs up. There you go. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. And say, hit the subscribe button. Subscribe button. Say, subscribe. Say, subscribe button. Subscribe button. Hit the subscribe button down below. And turn your bell notifications on so you will know when I upload my next video. Until next time, thank you guys so much for watching. Bye. Bye. Can you blow my kiss? All right. Hi, guys. I know I got bang channel. Look at the letter here. Thank <laughs> you.